Hey everyone, it's been a while since my last video. I hope everyone is doing good. In this video, I will cover updates and enhancements added to DatePickerX 3.0 and how to implement them in your project. If you're new to this, it is a free date picker which is compatible with both 32-bit and 64-bit Excel, which you can simply drag and drop into your project to use it. It is developed using VBA and user phones, so you do not need to install any third-party software for this. Going forward, I will be adding new contents regularly, so please do not forget to subscribe for latest updates and also kindly share these contents with your friends. The new features that has been added to 3.0 are 1. Flexibility to set the first day of the week and 2nd is the language mapping for the non-English users. So in the previous versions, Sunday was default first day of the week. In 3.0, you can set any day as the first day of the week as part of your requirement. And in 3.0, I've also added a language mapping uh, or a settings for non-English users. So if you're looking to add a language other than English, you can map them out in the date picker uh, language mapping sheet. These features will be added to all the variants of or the versions of date picker X and can be downloaded from the link provided in the video description. Setting up the first day of the week is very simple. You just need to locate this module, um, mDatePickerX, and you need to set value for this variable. So just specify three characters of, you know, of the day. Uh, for Monday, you just specify MON, for example. For Saturday, if you want the, your week to start uh, by Saturday, you specify in this, uh, in this fashion. So let's say that um, at the moment, if I have to check this, um, so hold on. Let me check the non English. So here, Monday is the first day of the week. Um, and if I go to date picker X here and set this as Friday as the first day of the week, see that Friday is the first day of the week and the date will automatically, you know, uh, pick up from there. Okay, so it's as simple as that. Um, just locate this module and update this variable. Now, let me also quickly show you about the language pack. So, um, within the file, you see that there is a sheet called date picker X lang map. So, if you go there, uh, basically, you can set um, for the year as well as uh, day of the week. As you can see from the label, you can make it out. So, you know, you can rename all this as far as uh, you need. So, these are settings for the month. Uh, these are settings for all the numbers, uh, you know, uh, dates uh, for the month. And then these are for the week, as I mentioned, and these are for the year. Uh, basically, you need to fill out all these ones um, and try it out yourself. So, for example, let's say that I want to set um, this as, you know, um, something else. Let's call this uh, Z, something like that. And if you load this up, you'll see that um, this is Z now, right? So um, that is that is how you can map them accordingly. Um, but you'll see here that the dates are still being calculated in English. So uh, when you write them here in write the output, you can still manipulate the format however you want it to be done. Okay, so be sure to include this um, sheet as well, and you can hide them uh, from from your project file. Um, just be sure to drag this one as well into your project. And as far as the usage, it's gonna be same as um, you know how we've implemented it for others. You can try it out, and if you do have any questions on these new features, uh, please do let me know. As far as the walkthrough, uh, since in the previous videos I've done a detailed walkthrough or how to implement this into your projects, I'm gonna skip that uh, in this video. Uh, please refer to the link in the video description for how to implement them uh, or walkthrough videos. And if you do have any questions or encounter any bugs or issues, please do let me know in the comments and then I'll come back to you as soon as possible. So that will be all for today. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.